Hi, this is Cat White, and this video will show users of Adobe Fireworks how to scan, crop, and save an image. I'm going to open Fireworks by going to the Start menu, All Programs, clicking on Adobe Master Collection CS5, and then scrolling to the list, which is alphabetical, to Fireworks, which has the gold icon. Once Fireworks opens, I'm going to click on the File menu, and I'm going to choose Scan from the list. The first thing I need to do is choose my scanner, so I'm going to click on Twain Select and choose my scanner from the list, which is the Scanjet G3010, and I'm going to click Select. And now I'm going to scan the photograph, so I go back to File, Scan, and this time I choose Twain Acquire, or Get the Picture. So I choose Acquire, and now I have the option of doing a preview or scan. And I'm going to scan right to Fireworks, so I'm going to click on Scan. The first time that you scan, you have to wait patiently for the bulb to warm up and the scan to start working. And then the pictures will show up in the window. Now I'd like to crop this, but I want to see the entire picture, so I'm going to hold down the control key, tap 0, and that changes the view to reveal all. I'm going to choose the crop button from the tool menu, which is on the left side. And this changes my cursor to the little box that you see. I'm going to hold down the left mouse button and drag a box around the image that I would like to select. I don't have to get the image precisely right the first time. I can make it the approximate size that I want. If I need to zoom in, I can hold down the control key, tap the plus sign, which zooms in so that I can make the box more precise. I'm going to adjust the top of the box by using the handle at the top in the center, and I'm going to do the same thing at the bottom so I don't have any extra white showing. And after I've got it adjusted, I can hit the Enter key or double-click the left mouse button, and that adjusts the picture to the size that I would like. I'm now going to save it by holding down the Control key and tapping S for Save. And then I'm going to save my photo by giving it a meaningful name and number, and I'm going to say Save. And that's all there is to scanning, cropping, and saving an image in Fireworks.